This video is about, um, you'll see them advertised as seen on TV, um, the Handy Stitch. And this is a deluxe um, set. I'm not sure if this is how they ship from like QVC or somewhere like that. I bought this secondhand, but it was sold as new old stock. And the reason I picked it up is because it came with the DC adapter, and I didn't have one for one of these. So you open it up, and there are the directions. Now, this is not the Singer handy stitch. Before Singer made a stitch so quick, they made a handy stitch. And if you um, look at, if you just do a search online for handy stitch, you have to be careful because um, one comes in typically a blue box that says right across it as seen on TV, and the other one is a Singer handy stitch, which I think is vintage because the current Singer model seems to be the stitch so quick. So, but this is the as seen on TV handy stitch. And um, there it is. And this, like I said, is the deluxe set. So you get extra bobbin. Now one thing to notice right away, the spool pin is much thicker plastic than the one that came with the Smart Tech. So you get the bobbins, the spool pin, a needle threader, and a couple of needles. Now this takes the 24X1 size needles. This is an advantage. This is how it's stitched. I've already used it. Beautiful stitches. This is wool. Um, the shorter needles, the 24X1 needles, are an advantage because what it allows you to do is have almost a quarter of an inch of space under, uh, in between the needle and, and where the fabric goes. The Singer Stitch So Quick takes a longer 15X needle and I would use that for single fabric or maybe two cotton layers but the hand, this handy stitch takes a shorter needle which gives you less of a hassle with putting the fabric under the needle now it comes with um, I think there are 32 uh, spools of thread here and it also came with 32 bobbins that I have already put in a bobbin box. So that's quite a bit to come with. Um, now, you may notice, you know, that these are all made in China, but you may wonder why they use such bright colors. If you think about it, if you're a tailor and you're going to make a suit for somebody, you want to stitch it up um, without finishing the stitching fit it to the client, and then finalize it. These chain stitchers, a little bit more so than the Model 20 by Singer, um, can be used as um, chain stitch machines to make what used to be called a muslin. When you make a fitted pattern for a clothing item, it's usually called a muslin. And by using these bright colors, um, for example, if you're making a dress, you do the sleeves in a pink, you do, um, I don't know, the gathering or the waistline in a red or a yellow, you can color code your own changes that you have to make. Um, and you could get into such a habit of that that green always means the sleeves or something like that. So there's, um, it's not just wow those are pretty there's more of a reason um, for them to give you bright colors now it also comes with a bag which holds the actual stitcher um, the needle little needle and bobbin things and the DC adapter which is in here um, now with the DC adapters they're not all the same they, some of them, they're mostly rated 6 volts, and then, I don't know what this means, but 600 MA, and I don't know what that means. The Singer is rated 800 MA. 
so I'm going to not struggle with that. So don't buy one of these for the DC adapter thinking you can use it in your singer. Um, now I have to say, I had this all together and using it and everything. I really like it. I know it's one of the um, cheesier ways of buying things in some ways. You know, those as seen on TV, call the 800 number. Um, but it really works well right out of the box. Now, it's little things like the tension knob. That plastic is like twice as thick as what was on the Smart, uh, smart Tech. The bobbins are metal. Um, the spool pin was heavier plastic. The whole thing is heavier. There's no batteries in this right now, but the whole thing is heavier. So this, I believe, is worth buying, especially if you find um, a new old stock vintage set like this. But this one is squeaking, and I think it is because it's probably a little older, and the grease on the gears is maybe sticking in a spot. It only squeaks once every, like, 20 inches. Um, but if this goes, I can just buy another one and still use all the accessories with it. So, um, and then when you buy them singly without all these other things, you can get them for about nine ninety nine. And if, if they look like they're the same quality um, with a thicker plastic on most things, then I feel these are worth it. And, um, you know, I, I can, I've been sewing things in a final way by using chain stitch. Um, I made a vest. Um, I made a quilt top. But you can use them as a tailoring item, especially around Halloween and costuming. I know when my son was little and I made all of his costumes, you know, the worst thing was, um, finishing it, putting it on him, and it was too tight or, or something. And if I had done it in chain stitch, I could have ripped that out very much more quickly than it took with a lock stitch. So there are a lot of advantages to these other than just being portable and um, easy to use and fun. <laughs>